Sumner Stroh, an Instagram influencer, has reacted to Adam Levine's denial of their affair and apparent downplaying of their relationship as merely flirtatious. The Maroon 5 frontman, 43, finally spoke out on Tuesday for the first time since Stroh, 23, publicly claimed in a now viral TikTok video last year that she had an illicit relationship with the married singer. Keep watching as we will tell you everything you need to know. Hey and welcome to yet another incredible celebrity news and gossip video. In this video, we'll talk about how Adam Levine challenges Sumner Stroh for tarnishing his reputation. But first, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to ensure that you don't miss any of our future videos. Let's get started. The allegation surfaced just four days after Levine's supermodel wife, Bahati Prince Lou 34, confirmed the couple's third child was on the way. Levine admitted to crossing the line and being inappropriate with another woman, but he seemed to imply that the relationship was not physical. I use poor judgement in speaking with anyone other than my wife in any kind of flirtatious manner, said the pop rock singer in a social media statement. I did not have an affair, but I crossed a line during a difficult period in my life. It has become inappropriate in some cases. I have addressed it and am making proactive steps to address it with my family. My wife and my family are all I care about in this world, he continued. To be so naive and stupid to put the only thing that truly matters to me at risk was the biggest mistake I could ever make. I'll never do it again. I accept complete responsibility. We will get through it and we will do so together. Stroh has since mocked his comments, writing in an Instagram story, someone get this man a dictionary, most likely referring to the definition of the word affair. Stroh's claims in her TikTok video in which she claimed she and Levine had been seeing each other for about a year and included a flirty message exchange appear to contradict Levine's statement. The shocking revelation sparked a social media frenzy, with critics branding her a home wrecker and accusing the young model of deliberately choosing to date a married man. Stroh responded to the comments in a second video posted hours later, expressing remorse for her actions and apologising to Levine's wife. The social media star, who had recently moved to Los Angeles at the time of their fling, also claimed that she had mistakenly assumed Levine and Prince Lou's marriage was over at the time. The most important part that I definitely glossed over was the fact that I thought their marriage was over, she said in a subsequent TikTok video. I assumed they were keeping it quiet to avoid negative press because as I had previously stated, I was new to LA and assumed that's how it was with celebrities of their calibre. That's why I feel exploited, because he knew I believed everything he said because of my vulnerable position as a newcomer to the Los Angeles. Stroh's video was created in response to a comment on our original video that stated, It's no secret he's been married for a decade. His wife and children are the only victims here. She claimed she had no reason to doubt what Levine told her about the state of his marriage because he had been communicating with her via his verified Instagram account. I now realise that was probably his manipulation tactic, hiding in plain sight, she added. As soon as I realised that wasn't the case, I ended things with him. In retrospect, I wish I had asked more questions. I wish I wasn't so naive, but being naive isn't an excuse for what I did in the role that I played for this. Again, I was not seeking sympathy and I fully recognise that I am not the victim in this. It's Bahati and her children who are really suffering here, not me, and I apologise profusely. Stroh stated again that she chose to come forward after learning that one of her friends had allegedly gone to the press with their claims and that she wanted to kill whatever story the tabloid had. At first, I wanted to go and express my remorse and how embarrassed and disgusted I was with myself, but I didn't want people to think she was playing the victim, she explained. One thing I now realise, I didn't mention enough that one of my friends had tried to sell it. I realised yesterday when they contacted me for a comment, which is why I was so concerned. Stroh had sparked a social media firestorm hours earlier when she took to TikTok for the first time to reveal details of her alleged illicit relationship with Levine. The model, who now lives in Los Angeles after attending the University of Texas, posted screenshots of their flirtatious exchanges on Instagram, including one strange message in which Levine asked if he could name his new baby after her. Essentially, I was having an affair with a man who is married to a Victoria's Secret supermodel, she explained, referring to Levine's wife, Bahati, 34, who is now expecting their third child. I was young and naive at the time, and to be honest, I feel exploited. I wasn't as involved in the situation as I am now, so I was definitely susceptible to manipulation. Stroh, who did not elaborate on their encounters, pointed to one Instagram DM between the two in which Levine writes, It's unreal how effing hot you are. It blows my mind. 
in person you're 50 times hotter, he adds. Stro, who has over 338,000 Instagram followers, claims she and Levine were seeing each other for about a year before losing contact over a period of months. However, the 43-year-old musician later contacted her in June of this year to inform her that he and his wife of eight years were expecting their second child. To her surprise, the heavily tattooed singer asked if he could name the child Sumner, if it was a boy, a request that Stroh described as horrifying. Alright, serious question. I'm expecting another child, and if it's a boy, I'd like to name him Sumner. Are you okay with that? According to a screenshot of the conversation, Levine said dead serious. After reading the strange message, Stroh said she finally feels like she was in hell. I mean, my morals were unknowingly tainted. I was completely manipulated she said in a now viral TikTok video. She explained that she had never intended to address the situation publicly and was well aware of the consequences of being tied to a story like this. Stroh stated that it was only after her friend, to whom she had confided about the affair and had sent the screenshots threatened to make her story public, that she became determined to tell her own story. I wanted to deal with this privately. I never wanted to come forward because I obviously understand the implications of doing what I was doing. Making money the way I do and being an Instagram model, she added. I had recklessly sent some screenshots to a few friends I thought I trusted and one of them had tried to sell it to a tabloid. As a result, I'm here. Stroh did not provide an exact timeline for the affair, but the allegation surfaced just five days after Prince Lou confirmed their pregnancy on Instagram, sparking widespread speculation. At the time, Prince Lou and Levine were photographed having lunch together early this month in Santa Barbara, where the soon-to-be mother of three had her burgeoning baby bump on full display. She's thought to have been pregnant as early as July when the couple was seen celebrating their eighth wedding anniversary in Maui, Hawaii. Levine had been the ultimate playboy before marrying Prince Lou in a romantic ceremony in Cabo San Lucas in July 2014, dating a Victoria's Secret model Anne Villasana and Nina Agdal as well as a rumoured fling with Jess Simpson. Dusty Rose, four, and Geo Grace, three, are the couple's two daughters, and together they founded the tequila brand Cali Rosa in 2021. Prior to Sumner's revelations, the couple appeared to have one of the most solid marriages in showbiz, but cracks have now begun to appear in the recent weeks. The couple sold their $51 million Pacific Palisades California 10-bedroom, 14-bathroom home in May. That's all we've got for now. Thanks for watching, guys. What are your thoughts on the video? please share them in the comment section below. If you enjoyed the video, please share it and subscribe to our celebrity news and gossip YouTube channel for more exciting content. We'll see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.